everyone uh welcome to another video and today i'm going to be showing you how to make a time and generator system in minecraft for uh your fnaf maps uh so uh i'm still working on fnaf 1 uh i'm almost done it's gonna be out very soon uh all i have to do is like uh add a couple things and then connect it all together and that's about it so uh let's just get into it okay so uh you're gonna want to get these blocks a command block on uh, any block of your choice personally i'm going to use gray concrete a chest a redstone comparator a hopper redstone dust a block of redstone redstone torch redstone repeater you can pause the video while you get these items, uh, but I'm gonna continue on. So, I'm just go anywhere in your world where you wanna place it. I'm gonna build mine right here, one block above the ground. And then you're going to build a platform like this and place however many uh, chests uh, you want, which is gonna act as how many uh like things you want to pop up before your time runs out or your power runs out so since i'm doing power since that's what you guys wanted uh i am going to place four you're going to want to place any block of your choice in the middle of those except for like a redstone block and you want to place a comparator on top of them then a hopper on top of those Okay, and then uh, any block of your choice on top of it. And then three lines, oh, however many lines of redstone you need. And then one block right there in the middle. Now, this is the basic system and we're going to keep adding onto it. You're gonna wanna place uh, any block of your choice in front of the chest and then place a comparator on all of them then build out one block and one block up break that pull a line of any block of your choice across and break the center ones and then place four redstone torches or however many you need and then if you want to uh have it do multiple command blocks uh, well, if you want to have just one command block, you just gotta place it in front of the redstone torch, and then it will just do its thing. But if you want to have multiple, you have to pull it out like this, and then place a repeater that continues on with command blocks like this, and then another repeater like this. But I'm not gonna do that for this tutorial. Uh, you can add however many blocks you want to that, but I'm not gonna be doing that. So you're gonna wanna place command blocks on all of the torches, like this, and then you're going to want to uh, do this command inside of them. Title, at a action bar, And then, uh, whatever your, uh, like, per, like, thing you're doing. So, I'm going to be doing the power, so this is going to be 75%. You're going to just want to do a, that all, like, along them. Uh, you can skip ahead if you're done, so... Okay, I did that wrong, like that. Okay, okay. And then, finally,
zero percent. Now, this is all fine and cool, but how are we going to uh, make it uh, a timer? So, what you're going to want to do is get any block of your choice, any amount you want, but it has to fit within the hopper, and you're going to want to like place it into the hoppers. So, I'm going to do a stack for each. And uh, that will unpower the redstone torches, which will power, this will power the comparator, which will then unpower the redstone torches. And as long as there's items in this hopper, this will not change. Uh, but when we want it to change, uh, all we have to do is to break this redstone block, which will then start funneling uh, the items into this chest. And when uh, the items are out, out of the chest, it will say 75% because that's what we wanted. And it will start funneling these. So uh, I'm going to place the redstone block back and then it's going to stop funneling. And now I'm going to reset this. Uh, this right here. Now, how are we going to refill it uh, without having to fly over here and manually refill it? The easy answer, slash clone. How are we gonna do that? Well, you're going to only need the things that are on this row. None of these need to be here. So you're gonna wanna get out uh, the gray concrete, the chest, the hopper, the redstone comparator, the redstone dust, and the block of redstone. That's all you're gonna need for the reset system. Now, you're just gonna wanna build it, the, like the an exact copy of what you built over there. Okay. So now that we have our build completed or our cloning thing completed, we're gonna wanna test it. So I already wrote down my coordinates, but the coordinates that you're gonna wanna get are these coordinates right here uh, and these coordinates right here, those ones. And so now you're gonna wanna bring out another command block and do clone whatever your coordinates were. So mine were 21, negative 58, negative, not negative, 11. And now you're gonna wanna test it before you do anything with this, cause you don't wanna mess it up. So I'm gonna do it right here. So 30, negative 59, nine. So I'm gonna do 30, negative 59, nine. And then you're gonna wanna have something to power it. So now if I press this button, there we go. And if you're gonna do anything with the clone command, make sure you test it before you do it. So now we know that it will uh, do it right here. So now that we got that, I'm just gonna do that. Okay, got that. And then, like that. Now I'm going to get these coordinates right here. So mine are, We're going to put these in a command block. So mine is 15. So now, if I start. 
start to drain this. I'm gonna get this ready. We're gonna wait for this to run out. So, I just wanna say if you're enjoying this, I hope this really helps. And uh, if you're following along, Thank you for watching uh, this, and I hope this really, really helps. Uh, thank you. All right. So now that this is done, uh, as we can see, there's none in this. If we click this button, nothing's changed. But if we go in here, 64, complete stack. And that is basically the entire camera system well not camera system uh power and time system for time you just like add two more and like on each of them and that's basically it uh that's the entire time system so now if you hook this up to something you can just reset it whenever you want uh like a reset uh, thing that I usually put in my maps to reset the time and animatronics. Uh, so yeah, that's basically the entire thing. If you enjoyed, uh, make sure to have a great rest of your day and uh, I'll see you in my next video. Peace out.